25-year-old Hector Molina became the owner of a brand new home courtesy of the Belize Family Life Association. The father of two opened the doors of the 16 by 20 feet home, fully equipped with electric and plumbing systems and a beautiful 16 by 6 feet veranda. Molina says when he got the news, he couldn't believe that he was the winner. I excited. <laughs> I mean, um, uh, I was very happy from the beginning. Uh, actually, that day uh, it was funny because um, when I got the call and everything, I couldn't believe it because uh, before that I had gotten a couple friends who had messaged me and and say congrats you want a host and i'm like no i didn't <laughs> and I, I get a next text from my next friend and he they're like you want a host and you know i get several no when i look upon five messages they tell me the same thing and there's something that happened you know and i got a call then from another friend who actually was in the states at that moment and he's telling me molina you in a house and they're like he here love fm and whatever and whatever and i'm like really and at that moment when I have that call, I got the call from, um, you know, from Love FM and that, well, I won the host. And I mean, I was so happy. And my wife was more happier than me. The home was initially purchased to the tune of $26,000 by the BFLA and was to be raffled in 2017. However, the raffle was drawn back to a lack of sales and tickets. According to Executive Director of the BFLA, Joan Burke Skeen, Earlier this year, the association's board decided to partner with the business community to push through with the fundraising efforts. We were supposed to raffle it at the agricultural show in 2019. And um, so we were un unable to. We continued to try and sell the tickets. It just didn't work out that way. And uh, so eventually the board decided to reduce the price from $50 per ticket to $25. With that, it allowed us to, to sell a little bit more. And then we decided to approach the business community where we made an offer that, okay, if you make a contribution of $1,000 to the association, then you get um, tickets. And um, so that's what we did. And that's when Molina's employer, Full Tech Systems Limited, contributed $1,000 and distributed the tickets among the staff. Molina says that after having years of bad luck, it was such a blessing when his manager called to inform him that he was a new homeowner. That generous act was actually thanked from the beginning and actually when I won the house, she was one of the first persons that I called and advised that I won the house and, uh, you know, told her thank you again that, you know, she gave me the opportunity and everyone the opportunity to win and, you know, I was lucky enough to win something because I'm not really lucky, <laughs> you know, but win a house, I mean, it was worth all that while I didn't have any luck in, in anything else. <laughs> but while Molina was a winner, According to Burke, the association took a loss of over $13,000 on the initiative. We took a loss maybe of at least thirteen dollars or $14,000. But the board decided that, you know, we will continue to fundraise to pay, to pay back. So that's where we are. Um, we are happy that we've done with this. The house was constructed by Premier Homes. And um, we got out, you know, they, they worked with us. We decided the day um, of the raffle that we also wanted some additional prizes. And so we got two prizes from Premier Homes. We also had friends of um, BFLA who made, you know, donation of prizes. So we were able to give eight um, additional prizes. Molina will be living in the house with his wife and two kids ages 8 and 7 months old and will now have the luxury of seeing his mother every day since the house was placed right next to hers. He says that receiving an entire home will surely change his life. To be honest, I mean, they, I mean a house, the, 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 there's so much uh, benefits to it. I mean, the fact that you don't have to pay rent, you know, uh, through this pandemic time, uh, it, it alleviates a lot of stress on me, right, because I'm the sole provider um, and my wife takes care of the kids. So, I mean, that th th this will help me in that aspect there. So I'm very grateful for that. And you're close to mom, right? And I'm close to mom, yes. Molina's name was chosen from a batch of 769 tickets that were placed in a raffle bin. Reporting for Love News, I am Vigil Alvarez.